From a Postgres compatible YSQL shell, let's go ahead and create a database called Club Data. Let's then switch to the Club Data database. Now let's create a schema called non-public. Then let's create a schema with authorization. Next, let's go ahead and call the necessary scripts from the Yugabyte share directory to create the database objects that we need for our Club Data database. Once our database objects have been created, we're ready to invoke the script from the same share directory that's going to load data into those objects. Once we have data loaded into those objects, we can just take a quick look to see what tables were created. Now let's switch on over to dBeaver. And from here, if we expand the club data database, we can see the schemas that we created. Drilling down into the CD schema, we can see that the tables that we created are there. And we can also do a simple verification that we do indeed have data.